Hello. In this tutorial, we would see how to create a pause order. To take a pause order, the take order option in the task button list must be enabled. This can only be enabled through the roles in admin module, which in its turn must be assigned by the HO or the head office. By clicking on the take order option, the pause order window opens up. Either tag or create a customer. So we tag the customer and click the OK button. Now we scan the items. We add the due date. We see the scanned items in the order items display area. The order items display area shows the barcode, the item's name, quantity, rate of the item, due date, salesperson name, delivered quantity, cancelled quantity and remarks. The due date can be specified on the top right corner or can be specified explicitly for a particular item. Similarly, a salesperson can be assigned to all the items by clicking the assign salesperson to all button. Or you could select the salesperson's name for a particular item. From the lookup in the ordered item display area. To record if the client has requested the goods to be delivered at his place, we use the home delivery required checkbox. Now we click the save button to save the order. Note that the status on the top right corner changes from new to delivery pending. A notification comes up to inquire if the customer is paying any advance. We click yes to create a credit note against the payment. The deposit adjustment window opens up. Select your desired mode of payment and accept the amount by clicking issue credit note and save button. This creates a credit note. And the deposit is saved with creation of a deposit adjustment bill. You can also choose not to take any deposits while taking the order by clicking on the no button which closes the pause order window. Please remember that pause orders can also be created from the back office module. So we've seen how to create pause orders. To know more about Genesis, subscribe to our channel. Thank you.